what we created is a village. It has five village members, you can say, which are also five houses. And they are standing in a circle looking at each other. They are very house-like, but at the same time they have a personality and a face. We are very interested in that connection between you as a person and, and the house as a kind of a reflection of a of a person, of a human. Yeah, we really wanted them to have some kind of inner life in these houses. And you can maybe see the smoke as a kind of communication between uh, the buildings. And also it kind of activates the space, the smoke. When people came in, they would be kind of embraced by the space. So what we decided to do was to make two towers. And they are kind of the head of the family. You could see the village as a sort of family and you have uh, the mother and the father tower in each end protecting and with walls kind of embracing the inhabitants. When we work with a project we start getting a certain view of things and then we that's kind of our way of seeing the world so we started seeing faces all around us and then we kind of also remember experiences from back from our childhood of of space. The first thing we did with the house was a small hut. You saw a small hut in the distance and what we had done was actually some kind of person looking back at you and re reflecting your view and we found that very interesting the part of when you're in an exhibition you look at works but that the work can kind of return your gaze. When we uh, found out about the island and we were so pleased to be situated here because um, this place has a really special uh, history with all the um, prisons and, and also ship making and we also talked about it. It was really great thing that we to build this village in here because you don't respect to see when you enter old architecture like this and then you come in and you have these houses standing here. Going from one house, which we've worked with before, and then to creating an entire village, you start to think very much about the relationship between the different parts. Is it something nice? In a way, it's nice to have a wall and a surrounding and a kind of a safe environment, but it could also be claustrophobic. And it also has the aspect of who's, who's included and who's in excluded in our work. And I think, a lot of the time when we build something, it has something very playful and could be kind of funny, but then it also has this layer of excluding people. One of the way we do that is by having these houses that, that you're not allowed to enter. You really much have to use your imagination to kind of finish this. What is very important for us when we do a work is that it actually gives people room to think themselves that we don't have a, is the village a good thing? Yeah, maybe, maybe it isn't. Uh, maybe it connects to larger issues uh, in society. This is good, this is bad. We actually want to create a space that encourages people to think for themselves. For themselves yeah.